So we've considered the basic technique now um, on how to chip the ball effectively on the green. What we're going to be looking at is how the ball will roll differently with a different golf club in our hands but using the same technique. Sometimes you'll find the nearer you are to the flag, the less roll you want on a ball, therefore the more loft on the golf club you want to use. Um, the further away from the flag you are, the more roll you possibly want so the ball runs up to the hole. So therefore, less loft on a golf club. But the beauty of this um, chipping technique is that you use the same technique regardless of the golf club that you're using. So let me just demonstrate now with three different golf clubs. So first of all, I'm going to be using a 56 degree uh, sand wedge. And this is for a shot that uh, requires the ball just to roll a little distance up to the flag. So that was the sand wedge and the ball doesn't run very much which is the type of shot that I want. I'm then going on to the pitching wedge which has slightly less loft than a sand wedge. It's 48 degrees of loft. So less loft than the sand wedge which will make the ball run a little bit more. But I want that because I'm further away from the flag. So the same technique. and the ball runs up to the golf hole. Then I go on to the seven iron. So what you've seen are three different types of shots from one technique. All that you're doing is changing the golf club to fit the purpose of the shot, but you're keeping the same technique. This way you have less to think about on the golf course and hopefully this will help you to improve your scores. So one technique, just change the golf club to suit the particular purpose. So if the flag is nearer to you, and you don't want the ball to run very much on the green, you take a golf club that has more loft, something like a sand wedge. If the ball is further away from the green and you need to get the ball to run up to the hole, you have to take less loft, something like a seven iron or a six iron to make the ball run. But remember, it's the same technique, just change the golf club to fit the purpose.